sure there's no cuts. Looks pretty good. You see me walking on it, it's just gonna happen. Rose is cheaper than the top is. Buy yourself some Rose Wilson here, it's like 20 bucks. These are the flashback arresters, these are one-way flow valves. Flash guard, uh, there's one on each side. And you have an arrow on the flow goes in one direction. It looks pretty good. I can't quite see what's under the warning label. Good job there, guys. <laughs> 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 it's kind of right. So everything looks good. We already cracked the valves, we already cleared them, we already cut the regulators. Uh, let's see, pressure's already set to a little bit around 10-ish. I'm going to throw it down the air because we have all this pain. That's a three. Uh, looks pretty good. Sweet. My gloves on. My shoes on. Torch lighting review for the ones who weren't here. Very good. Very good. Yeah. Grab, pull, push, pull, 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 This is how to operate a fire extinguisher. So, just remember what I told you during the video. Turn on the acetylene. Clear. Not a big deal. It's on really low right now. It's probably going to be really steady. Yep. Turn around a bit more than that. <laughs> Another way of saying this is the torch is not, uh, the goggles are not necessarily for uh, safety as much as they are for comfort. Uh, Alright, that's not working, so I'm going to turn it off and get this situated. No, no, safety first. Eh, common sense is. <laughs> This particular pair is not very flexible. Alright, now I can see it. Cool. I feel slide down my face too. It's great. Alright, try this again. I'm going to turn it up a bit. It's kind of scary and loud, but you're not going to die from it. You know? It's not the end of the world. i got it turned on really high right now. Woo! Not the end of the world. Alright. Add a little oxy. They say turn it all the way on. Our day is going to be really short. Oxy is really low. All right, there's the cones. Oxy is really freaking low. This sucks. Yep, we ain't going to cut shit today, guys. I can't believe that oxy is that low. So right now the oxy is all the way on. Fairly thin stuff, it's going to be fairly easy to cut. You get it right up on there until it glows red, and as soon as it gets wet, you blast through it. And as you can see, I told you I'm not that good. Let's do it again. Back off, let it cool, because now what happens if I try to keep doing it, the whole thing is a big molten mess and it's going to start melting through it. Everywhere. Now that the edges are jagged, I'm going to get that melt effect quicker. Not as easy as that guy made it look. Not enough oxy. It's out already. Not enough oxy, guys. That's what happens if you turn the fuel off before the gas, or before the oxygen. The guy says don't do it. Why? Well, it makes that little pop. It's really about all it does. It's not the end of the world. <laughs> yeah, so that's all the oxy I got. Turn the settling down to get that's the neutral flame. Those little cones are there, but they're way too freaking small to work with. You can weld with it for a few minutes and it's just you're gonna run out of oxy. It's just completely dead. Oh, okay. This sucks. Right? There's a lot of expert dummies out there. Yeah, <laughs> definitely one of them. Thank you. They never foolproof anything. You give a dummy 20, 30 years to train, he's a pretty good dummy. Yes, yeah, that's right. I'm going to have a proof of that. 
Alright, I'm gonna put this one on. Crack that to be safe. Get yourself out of the way and just crack it. Let it blow. That's good enough. Just good enough? Yep, that's it. Now go ahead and screw that on. Yes. Alright, now we're gonna put the wrench to tight tighten. And we're in business. So Casey, oh, just like so what? So what happened? How did we get some oxygen? What's that? How did we get some air? Casey. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> this is this is a deposition if you don't know it. <laughs> reasonably tight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, so it looks like That's we good. were we were blessed by being loaned some air from uh, Mr. These, Pettis these here. These guys are Pettis all the Pettis 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 If you ever yeah. need your car repaired, absolutely. Or anything, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Hey, I got news for you. The best deals you get out there in the auto repairs are from the shop that doesn't have a whole lot of crap overhead. This guy's got a nice clean place and doesn't have a whole lot of ads around town, so he's probably going to get some good work. I have an old uh, car that needs constant fixing. Um, okay, who thinks they're now brave enough until they watch me mess that up? So step in uh, and get started. I, I might do it. Right. All right, give it a shot. Yeah. Right. Okay, so I had turned this off. I'm going to turn it back on. Okay. We're looking for... To actually pressurize. Okay. All right, so that means we've got some pressure in the tank. Okay. Same thing over here. Turn it on. This one's okay. Got pressure in the tank. He's got some pressure in the tank. Okay, it's set to 30, way too high. Uh, crack the oxygen in the acetylene valves for me. The oxygen valve for me on the, the actual torch. I'm going to let that down so I can take the pressure down a little bit. Okay. Is that open? Uh huh. A little bit more, it's dropping slowly. There you go. That bottom there. Can you close this? No, keep it open, keep it open. Now please. Okay. All right, we're looking at like a 10 or 11 pounds. Okay. Good. And then over here, we're still at three. Open the assembly for me. Okay. Assembly down to one, two, three, fish. All right, try and close it. Okay. Well, we're pretty much ready. All right. Got your gloves on. You got your face covered. Uh -huh. Your eyes covered. Uh, the strikers over there. So what you want to do is turn the oxygen on that all the way on. Striking real fast. You just kind of do this whole thing. Yeah. Got it. Get used to that. Okay. All right. I'm sorry. Crack the red one first. Okay. Which is the second. So the fuel on. Okay. You can hear it. Now go ahead and hold it away from anything. Just get it. Okay. Uh, probably should set the striker down. Turn your oxygen on all the way. And turn it up pretty wide. Now adjust your flame. All right, that's pretty high. Now what you want to do is you want to get so that this controls what happens when you squeeze. Right. So or squeeze right now. I'm sorry, squeeze right now. Adjust these two to where they look the same when you squeeze. Oh, okay. Just a little bit brighter when you squeeze. So adjust this one. Turn that one on.
<laughs> Maybe draw two lines before you start. Then we'll call you at. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you guys remind me of in laws to an IT guy. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Try that one. I mean, you've done that one. Before. I'll bolt on my piece of metal. Or I'll, I'll clamp on my piece of metal to help you draw a straight line. Give me the first one. Much better, huh? Oops, oops. Okay, burn a hole in it. <laughs> you can go back to the torch. That's really quick right there. Yeah, I've got it before. It's coming from the left side. You have to do that hole. Just yep. Like there you go. I'm holding it. Now we can probably break off. Woo! Alright, let me clamp you on a uh, straight edge. Magnet you on a straight edge. Yeah, you have to get a feel for a Sweating. Yeah, it's really hard to say it in English language, I mean, uh, in any language. Show you how to do it, teach you what not to do to burn yourself, or, and then just let you get the feel for it from there. Um, yeah, again, let, let the parts of the torch rest against that, and let that be straight edge guide for you. It's too far away, I can give it up, and just let it go, and just try to straight it. I realized that it kind of gets caught in the metal. Yeah. So yeah. I'm like stopping and then I'm going too fast. It's like we should put some like, it's like we should put some graphite lubricant or something on there. Huh? Yeah. So all right, hot shot. Mark was in first. Yes. Uh, don't forget to turn off the tip off as well. And then. Yeah. Put these goggles on. <laughs> <laughs>